How can I place a pending order? From the main trading window, select the desired instrument from the drop-down list and confirm the switch is set to pending position. Set the desired trigger price for the symbol and whether this is a buy limit, sell limit, buy stop or sell stop. To set stop loss and take profit points, click the button marked Set SLTP and a pop-up box will appear. On this box, you can check the box to set a stop loss and or take profit price. And you can also edit the symbol, the trade size, the order type and the order price. You can also create an expiry date, which will automatically delete the pending order if it has not been previously triggered by that date. Once the order has been customized, click the Place button to create the pending order. Pending orders are displayed on the bottom of the trading window inside the Pending Orders tab. How can I view, edit and delete my pending positions? On the bottom of the trading platform, you will be able to see your trade portfolio. This consists of three separate tabs, which contains your open positions, pending orders and closed positions. In the Pending Orders section, you will see an entry for each pending order that has been created, reflecting the order type and the order's trading size. If the pending order will expire, if not triggered by a certain date, the expiration time is shown. In the next section, the trigger price is displayed, and when a stop loss and or take profit has been created, those trigger prices are shown as well. Finally, you are able to see the current price of the symbol. Clicking in any of the editable fields, expiration time, stop loss or take profit will bring you up the pending orders edit menu. This is similar to the window used when creating a pending order, except that the trading size cannot be changed from the edit window. Please see the video entitled Placing a Pending Order for more information on creating pending orders. If you wish to delete the pending order, click the X box underneath the action section. A confirmation pop-up will appear and you will need to delete the order. Deleted orders are removed from the Pending Orders tab. 